Hello world. Today I woke up not in a great mood. I have a lot of pressure on my face. Last night I had a hard time breathing. It just felt like mucus was just covering my breathing space on my throat. It was really hard. I had to sleep elevated and I was coughing a whole lot. And this morning I just felt like not my natural vibe, that's for sure. I'm usually tired, yes, but positive and very hopeful for my day. This morning, not so much, and I hate it. I hate feeling that way. I don't like feeling that way because it's not me. But I took every effort to get out of bed and go to Weight Watchers this morning. I'm on my way there, and I'm pretty certain I gained for my birthday weekend. ate a lot, and I pretty much counted every single point that I ate, but I still went over my weekend points. <sighs> Hopefully, it's not bad news, and I get good news, which will liven up my spirit. But regardless, it is what it is, and I need to go do it. It's what I'm paying for, right? So I gotta do it. And then right after here, I'm going straight to my doctor's appointment. <coughs> and hopefully I get good news there too, about maybe taking some medication or something to resolve this cough. All right, I got out of Weight Watchers and the doctors, and I stopped at Walmart, and now I'm at Market Basket with this guy right here. <laughs> He's doing the grocery shopping for me while I was at my appointments. And look at our carriage. Voila. Food for the week. And some laundry detergent. And some other essentials. And now he's trying to choose out a bar. So, okay, let's start with where I was before. Uh, Weight Watchers, I gained 0.4 of a pound. Not a huge gain, but still for me, it's like another week that I didn't lose something, so that just upsets me. But, I'm gonna keep going, can't give up. And number two, I went to the doctors, and the doctor said that I don't have bronchitis or anything like that, but she just thinks it's a viral cough that I need to just, I guess, let it take its course, which has been taking its course for a very long time. And so she gave me a lot of medications. I got an extra inhaler, plus the albuterol that I've been using. And then she gave me a cough medicine and vitamin D because I told her I've been really tired and she checked my levels and they were low. So she gave me the big booster horse tablet that you take, it's like 10,000, something like that. So I have that and then she gave me something for my skin because she said I have like a mile, I don't want to say myeloma because that's cancer, but a mile something. I don't remember what the name of it was, but apparently I have these white spots on my back and stomach that I thought were just sunspots related to the sun. And she said it's a yeast infection on my skin. Who would have thought, right? I would have never thought that I would have a yeast infection on my skin. So she gave me medicine for that too. So I gotta start using all that medication when I get home. And we gotta finish our groceries. Just got back from work. It was kind of hectic after we got back from the groceries. We put all the groceries away. Look at this lovely packed freezer here. And let's wait, I called this a freezer. Fridge. Fridge and freezer here. So we're all set with that and we're cooking dinner now. John got it started with the broth and I finished it up with all the veggies and stuff. So here's our lovely chicken pot pies. I'm gonna put the egg on it right now. You just brush the egg. It's egg wash. And you brush it on top. Yep, and then you put little slit holes so that it can breathe. And we were making it, and we've made veggie pot pies. Like, all the time we had pot pies, we made veggie pot pie. And because we were vegan, it was just strictly veggie pot pie. So now, we added chicken to this, and oh my gosh. It's like a whole nother meaning to chicken pot pie. Right, hon? Rotisserie chicken pot pie. But right, it's like a whole nother world. I don't know what we were doing. <laughs> He's like, I don't know what we were thinking. Why did we have, why did we take chicken away? Why did we take chicken away? <laughs> it's crazy when you don't have something for over a year and then you eat it again. I'm sorry, people say it's not gonna taste good to you. I don't know who those people are because it does t taste good to me. 
tastes actually exceptional. Better than I've ever had <laughs> before. <laughs> so I'm gonna bathe these tops. And I did a little something different with mine. These two are mine right here. Um, I did a little different with mine than Jonathan's because uh, usually you put the crust on the bottom and on the top. But because of the calories and points, I'm only mine only have the tops on it so, because it would be like 14 points if I put top and bottom. So because of the crust, it's going to be 7 points. And then I haven't calculated the inside filling yet, but it's not going to be that much more. I estimate about maybe, mm, maybe 2 more points for what's inside really. Because it's distributed between five pies. So it was mostly vegetables, chicken, uh, almond milk, water, uh, seasoning, and some rice flour. That's all it was. So Johnny did putting Johnny is doing the honors of putting it in the oven. We're gonna wait for those to cook and then we're gonna watch some CW! Which one do you want to watch? Show. It's the network that we watch the most shows on. So I'm going to check on the pot pies. I just had myself a snack. It was strawberries and grapes that we bought earlier at the supermarket. And they were delicious, sweet, and juicy. I loved it. And the strawberries, huge. I posted a picture on my Snapchat and my Instagram. Um, but just to give you a visual. These things are monsters. Bigger than my eye. Bigger than my nose. It's huge and juicy. I had five of those. Five big huge ones. And then I had like mm, two handfuls of grapes. Because there's zero points so, to hold me over till these things are done. Which, ooh, they look about done. So I'm going to pull these out and then let them cool down for a little bit. Ooh, look at that. Look at the top of that. It's an egg on top because I had remainder egg wash. So I put it on top of John's. This one's John's too. Oh yeah, look at that, like a pie. Mine, right here. Oh yeah, oh. <laughs> These look heavenly. John's oh my goshing over here. <laughs> Are you excited to eat chicken pot pie? Homemade chicken pot pie? Oh my <laughs> Look at these bad boys. All right, we're going to dive in. I'm going to put some pictures on Instagram and Snapchat. So if you're not following me already, follow me. Because I put a lot of like my food and other stuff that don't normally go in the vlog on there. All right, so I'm not at home. I forgot to end the vlog last night. You're not home. You're we at my watch. House. I said I'm not at home. Exactly. <laughs> this one over here. <laughs> I'm with Jay, and yeah, it's the next day. So, just gonna quickly end the vlog here because we need to start Saturday off. Do you want to tell them? Hit the like button if you like it. Hit the like button if you dislike it. Hey. Hit the like button what? If you comment. Hello. Subscribe. It's me. Jay, please subscribe so Stephanie can come back and doesn't hate me for life. <laughs> Shut up. Really sad. <laughs> He's playing Clash of the no, Royals. Clash Royale. Oh, Clash Royale. Whatever. <laughs> we'll see you manana. Remember to love your life. Bye. Fresh movie that just came out. So <laughs> it was pretty true to the story though. It was